Oh, my head hurts. Okay, uh, let's get to this mission then. I was gonna actually play a little bit earlier, but <laughs> kind of didn't feel like it. Moment. You, Eustace, the corpse collector. I. How'd you know? You smell it. Fourth sense, I think it is. You bring Fabian Meyer's body to the morgue. Fabian. Oh yeah, I remember. <laughs> no ice, no what. One of them, right? Yep. <laughs> no purse neither, as I recall. Oh. You searched him. You search Fabian's purse. body. Well, I uh, cast an eye in his pockets, <laughs> made sure nothing went to <laughs> waste. I call a spade a spade. You rob corpses. And I call a prick a prick. It's none of your fucking concern. What, you tax collector? Piece off, mutant. Everybody's going to piss me off. I'd advise you not to anger me, or you'll get an inside tour of the crematory. Touch me, the guys will be hiding your ass for you can't free. To save a little shit like you? Doubt it. He's clever, lads. More cleverer than you. They know you, this. No, they want me on their side. Cause you'll all die one day, and then I'll decide where your body winds up. A grave, the crematorium, or elsewhere. Tell me what you find. Here's some coin. That hard up for coin? Fine. Have some. Now talk. What did you find on him? Triflings, baubles, glass beaded wing, handful of coins, oh, and a leather? letter. Look, vellum, quality parchment, that. Oh. <laughs> I'll wipe off the right inner cell it as new. That's human skin. Priscilla, next victim's name. If you'd given this to the right person, she might not have been hurt. <laughs> what the fuck do I care what happens to some Priscilla? We saw a wenches in this town. Hit him. Boy, fucking hell, what was that for? For everything. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing pretty in this life save Shut death deals. Don't know nothing else. Go, oh, Lydica. <laughs> what happened here? Monsters Just must have run him down. The swarms in oh. His own fault, though. <clears throat> Washed your hair lately. Uh, where are you going? I think so. Anyone home? Be in the ordinary. Be gone, or I'll sick me hands on you. Molly, Striga, come! Relax. I'm here about Fabian Meyer, looking for his killer. That's altogether different. Sit your stupid much lie down. <laughs> Mine. Mine then. Slowly now, lest they bite you. <laughs> lest they bite you. <laughs> and you're? So who might you be? The Steph's brother. Gus is the name. We ran a workshop together. Meyer and Meyer. And that dog's bigger than you. What'll it be now? Just Meyer. Name it. I'll be closing it down now. As soon as I find a buyer for this shack, I'll head on to Mahakam. Be near my family or what's left of it. So, what do you want to know? What can I tell you about Fabian? Brother have any enemies? Your brother have any enemies? Anyone dislike him? Threaten him, maybe? It was Fabian who threatened this one last. Oh, you were a good dwarf. Craftsman like no other, but he was an incorrigible whoremonger as well. <laughs> Damn. Whenever we put a bit of coin aside, I'd say, Let's buy some tools, quality timber. No, he grabbed the purse and head out roaring. <laughs> Took to falling one in particular. He'd say, Tis all your fault, dirty bitch, human dish rag. And other obscenities. Damn. Don't rightly know what that was about. Maybe he was in love with her. Know where I can find her, this dish rag? City Cemetery. She died a few days back. Quietly in her sleep, her pawns said a fever took her. Damn. Know much about the murder? Tell me what you know about the murder, in order, in detail. It was like this. Had some work in Oxenfurt, okay. 
and I was coming home. I saw a plume of smoke rising over the city. thought to myself, blast it, gonna miss him burn another hag. But the smoke wasn't coming from Hyrax Square. It was coming from here. See the soot stains? That's where they burned our sculptures. Folk gathered round the blaze and found Fabian here beside it. They'd already loaded him on the cart by the time I arrived. Talk to your neighbors. They see anything suspicious beforehand, hear anything? Claimed not to. But even if they had, they'd not have helped. In Novigrad, folk give bleeding orphans in the street a wide berth so as not to stain their poor lanes. What do they care about some dwarf? Okay, we've talked enough. Fine, we've talked enough. Need to look around. Be my guest. Just be wary of the dogs. Bloodstains. That's where Fabian lay when they found him. Hmm, someone dragged something across the floor. More dragged it from one wall to the other, repeatedly. Statues of the old gods. Nothing but women. Shapely ones. Hmm. Mind if I go inside the workshop? It's not even peeked inside since... since they found Fabian. I'll open it for you if you want. Oh, if I can get in there. to death unless somebody got rid of the blood left a few stains behind formaldehyde doubt Fabian used it nothing here Alright, time to go. Oi, Witcher! Coroner wants to see you. Been another victim. Told me to say the main door will be open for you. You're to come as soon as you can. Awful pile. Oh. Hey, handsome. You scared. Whistling Wendy? A brazier. This time of year? Brazier, mm. this time of year. Grab him! Hey, sis, that him. How am I to know? <laughs> mm. ah, gotta get around him! Oh. 
shut up and fight. Too, huh? Up your ass, deviant! Holes can fight back! Uh. Calm down, I'm not gonna hurt you. What are you doing here? Getting vengeance. Well, why are you staring? Have you not heard killers always return to the scene of their crime? Me and my brothers are waiting here to give him a warm welcome for Priscilla. Almost did her in the whole sun. I know. Here to look for clues and find anyone who might know something. Fear I can't help you much, but I can tell you what I know. Priscilla wasn't this whole victim? Oh, that, don't you? Priscilla wasn't the sole victim. You aware of that? Oh, dearie. Of course I was. This didn't start yesterday. Others have died like this before. Beggars, street girls, orphans. Damn. But who'd have a drama concern about them? Human rubbish. It's what the guards call us. Recall any names? They didn't have proper ones. Baldy, curly, buns. That's what folk called them. No friends, no families. Their bodies were burned long ago. You and Priscilla are friends? You and Priscilla are friends? Friends? Nah. But she saw more than a stupid hoe in me. Treated me with respect. It mattered. I was looking to give up whoring. Pick up a decent trade. Ah. But none would take me. Not as a washerwoman, nor a servant, nor a cook. Felt like a leper, I did. But Priscilla, she was different. Agreed to put me in her play, you see. Lots of the other actors, they were afraid on account of her jesting about the eternal fire. Huh. Whistling Wendy on stage, can you imagine it? Well, dream's gone now. I'm back to work in street corners. Sorry to hear that. You could do worse as work goes. Or so I tell myself. Very well. Take care now. I gotta look around some more. Appreciate it if you didn't disturb me. Naturally, we'll stand aside, behave, but do tell us if you find anything else here. Oh, my head's ringing. I know that smell. Formaldehyde. Man's footprint. The murderer's, maybe. Weight on his heel. Human. Took a step back. Priscilla's. Murderer fled before the guards oh. arrived. Ran this way. So? Take care now. And I got a murderer to... Okay. Cool. Let's -a go. Back to the corner. Ugh, God damn this weather. What is it, great boy? Looking for adventure? Welcome, Master Witcher. Thank you. Ooh. Uh. Geralt, right? I'm glad you're here. Held off on the autopsy till you arrived. Nice of you. Especially given you didn't seem pleased about my previous visit. Because you came unannounced and in unfortunate company. Oh, cool. I also had Reverend Nathaniel to contend cool. with. Our spiritual caretaker has left the city on some important matter. And I know who you are, what drives you. I'm more than happy to aid oh. your investigation. Mr. Dautopsy? <coughs> Let's start. Gladly. <coughs> the wounds conform <coughs> to the killer's modus operandi. <coughs> the victim was bound and forced to drink formaldehyde. Uh -uh. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the rib cage and... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. 
A message from the murderer. The name of his next victim. Mm -hmm. Patricia Vagelbud. Do you know her? Yes. Even went to her estate once with... Gotta find her. Now. Let's go. Until oh. next time, Master. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't want to do no derby. I'll do the horse races after. At the end of the game. Okay, let's go. Param, 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 param. Let's talk to the guards. What do you want? Need to talk to Patricia Vagelbud. Need to talk to Patricia Vagelbud. You think any bum off the street can? Her life's in danger. Let me in, or have her blood on your hands. If you thought this up, and I'll let you in. You'll throw my ass out the door. Always thought a guard was supposed to protect his charge, not his ass. So be it. I'll take you to Lady Vagel, bud. Just no trickery. Understand? Okay. <clears throat> oh, Geralt. What a pleasant surprise. <clears throat> not pleasant at all. I gotta see your mother. Her life's in danger. In danger? Come now. I saw mother this morning. She seemed sad, true, but in perfect health. Murder has marked Patricia as his next victim. I'm hunting a serial killer, and I've got reason to believe your mother will be his next victim. Why, even if it's true, our guards... He's exceptionally cruel when he kills, tortures his victims, cuts out their hearts. So let's see how she is, just in case. I find this all very hard to believe, but you appear to be quite serious. Please, follow me. A fire fit for Bellatane, except it's the wrong time of year. I mentioned Mother seemed sad. Do you remember? In fact, she's in the midst of a crisis of faith. A rather serious one. We'd been to Novigrad. Mother had seen the pyres in Hierarch Square. But had not a word on our way home. She had all the holy books, insignias, reliquaries gathered, taken outside and burnt. Then she locked herself in her room. We need to hurry. Okay. Hear that? Calm, quiet. All seems to be in order. We should go in, just to be sure. You're relentless, aren't you? Fine. But wait here, please. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. <laughs> he... he ran out the other door! Catch him! Those soldiers thought to change their name now. Do you want to <laughs>
Okay, so what's gonna happen now? Halt! For I put a bolt between your eyes! Listen, you got the wrong guy. Save your trickery, taking you to the heiress. <sighs> well, killer's already escaped. Lead the way, hero. We got him, Lady Ingrid. Wasn't easy, but... Lower that crossbow before you hurt yourself. This man is innocent. Forgive me. I saw him running. Thought it was the killer fleeing. I was chasing him, and I'd have caught him if you hadn't gotten in my way. Mm. Out of my sight, at once! <clears throat> Mother, why did he do this to her? Why? Because she's, uh, a mid water for the eternal fire. Because she blasphemed the eternal fire, only thing that ties her to the other victims. Ingrid, I know this is a hard time for you, but usually the killer leaves a note on the body, a note indicating his next victim. May I? Very well. But you should be on your own. I do not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. And let her be the last victim. Please. Mm, I'm gonna just go back. Okay. Just didn't want to. Wow! All right, let's go. Just need to fast travel over there. I think hierarchy square is gonna be a little bit closer than that. Cool, cool, cool. As they say, last chance to surrender on orthodox books. Huh, I'm, I'm almost supposed to level one up again. Cool. Didn't take that long this time around. Sweet Nettie, where is she? Upstairs. Mm -hmm. But she's with a very important client. Do not disturb them. 
Hello, fella. Well met. I don't remember if this one has... No one will... All right, then they come back. All right. I had to close that because I wasn't sure if. Any of that was going to be able to. No. Go through YouTube. I um, mean, not YouTube, but uh, there's going to be any problems with Twitch or anything. reason I still think you too. Yeah, I need to sell some of this stuff, man. Okay, cool, there you go. I'm warning you. Dory? Greeting. Greetings, girl. Let me see what you got. What do you have? It's fine. I need to sell some of this uh, junk over here.
I think this is it. Very well. So long. Open up. Let me see. Mm. Well, you got to sell. Oops. How much does these boots weigh, though? Four pounds. It's always something. It's not weigh that much, though. Yeah. Well, that's good. See you. Yes, ma'am. I mean, yes, sir. Then the line. How's better, right? Y yes. Did you take care of what I asked? Yeah. The witch's way. Thank you, Geralt. For me and Priscilla. Did my part now you need to look after her? Did my part. Your turn now. Take care of her. Good care. I will. You'll see. Treat her better than the Dryads of Broccolon could. She's talking again. Nice surprise. Isn't it? Professor Von Gratz told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, <laughs> but encouraging. Yeah. Maybe she might even sing again someday. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute. I'll sing. Dandelion and Kalanetta. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion. On stage and off.
Sorry, Geralt. My throat's still quiet. Say no more. Get well soon. Okay, I think that's it. I think there's that, and then there's the the fighting one. That's it. Two last ones for for that, and then the the treasure hunts, of course. But the end, I, I really don't need the rest of these, though. Oi, Cocker! Now they've got their new king. Ooh. Perhaps the Skelligers will calm down. Me, the war I drink. Clear Power of the eternal fire. It's time to do this this last mission. And I can finish the game. And then just do the the, the the DLC. What's he doing here? Watch where you step. No. You watch where you step. Got a minute. I do. What do you want? Well, I uh, need help fighting it. Wasn't sure I should even ask you. Still not. But what the hell? I could honestly use some help. Oh, my help. Very interesting. Do tell. Wild Hunt's gonna attack Kaer Morin soon. It's a sure thing. Looking for people, resources, anything that'll help me repel them. The Wild Hunt? Don't tell me you believe that nonsense. Hardly nonsense. Got a taste of it. A painful taste. On my own skin. Oh. Hmm. Sorry, Geralt, but I've my own pile of problems just now. I've not recovered my lost property. Your help, you might remember, left much to be desired. So I don't owe you shit. Bastard. I thought I got him back his money. No? Not this time around? Huh. Okay, you gotta tuck this whole thing in. See if he can help. Got my eye on you. See his mug. Damn that son just. Zoltan. Get out. I need your help find the one hunt. I know where Siri is. Let's go get the lassie. I'll do that, but I have another job for you. You need to set out for Kaer Morhen. That's where I'll take Siri. The Wild Hunt will attack soon afterwards. Could use you at our side. You'll have me and my axe. Thanks. See you at Kaer Morhen. Besimir, Eskel, and Lambert are already there. Okay, now time to talk to Roach. things do do take care of yourself do do oh those bigots haven't the cunning to strip me of this mask there guy 
He's really rocking out to the song. Gotta talk to Roach. Hopefully he says yes. The Witcher. Just what I <laughs> 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 This is all over. I aim to open up. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Need your help defending Caramorn? Could use your <laughs> help at Caramorn. <Kaer> <laughs> aim to take Ciri there. <laughs> Wild Hunt's bound to appear soon after. You didn't turn your back on me when I was in need. It's only fair I do the same. Thanks. Venture to say your skills might prove invaluable. I'll consider whether to bring Vess. Either way, I'll see you at Caramorn. Hmm. <laughs> They're bringing his army. You've been here, you've so been there. Up, we'll pay for the free Tamaria. You trouble me, Grey Looks. That's the last one, huh? Oh, what? Hopefully it's saved. Hopefully it's saved. <sighs> Yeah. The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. Mists. You had to add the extra S's. I just gotta talk to the Emperor. Which I, I believe he says no. Okay. Yeah. 
folks in, in the, like, at least see you there. You've been here, you've been there. I need 30. <laughs> The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this Avalach. was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. It's nowhere and everywhere. Hey, what? Do you find Durgoff? I truly hope they'll allow themselves. Farewell. Majesty. Witcher, why have you come? I've managed to find out where Ciri is. Finally, I'd begun to doubt the wisdom of enlisting you. Bring her here at once. The wild hunts pursuing her. Kaer Morin's the only place she'll be safe. That was not a suggestion. I can defend my own daughter. I uh, see so it done myself. I doubt that. Can't compare the wild hunt to Temerian shield bearers or Lyrian archers. Facing it here would put Fizima at risk. Hundreds of innocents could die. Kaer Morhen is in a wilderness, and your army stands to be far more helpful there. Hmm. Agreed. I shall send a banner with you. On one condition, General Voris will lead it. Can't agree to that. And I cannot agree to witches commanding my troops. Well, I'm not about to give in. You don't look it either. Sorry to take up your time, your majesty. Bring me Ciri. I will, if that's what she wants. I knew it. I knew I was gonna... Garen wat gern, wat kelm. Best travel. Up to Skellige. Uh, so, where, where, where did it land though? Anywhere? I'll go there. The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. Oh, it's still, it's still 99 degrees outside. Needs worries like a boat needs ballast. Sail straight and even. Get on the boat. Swing an 
Next. Why can't it just tell me where it was at? If it just told me where it was at, I could have just no fast traveled there. Ain't gotten on the boat. We just jumped over the boat. There's also a good amount of uh, drowners here too. Just in case if you're in real quick I've been to that castle thing right I think I was pretty sure I had I can see the mist. going your game now I'll do it there's the one at the end yes Thank you. 
The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, Avalach. this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away Isles on the Mist. Isle of Mists. Mistesses. With three, min three S's. Hopefully it changes after this. Okay, let's go. Okay, cool. gonna hurt you. Open up. Oh, you blew a fucking <laughs> cover. Who are you? What do you want? Looking for a young girl with ashen hair. I'm Geralt, a witcher. Go away. Looking for a young woman, ashen hair, scar on her face. Will you let me in? No. Trying to get angry. Running short on patience. Wonderful. Means you're about to go the fuck away. My mum's beard, get yourselves together, lads. You there, outside the door. Geralt, that right? Yeah, Geralt. Listen, Geralt, let's cut to the thick of it. We survived a shipwreck recently. Beasts from the depths ate some of my lads, and the rest of us found shelter here. Not too special, that as dangers litter this isle, but it does go to explain why we're a wee bit distrustful. Don't want to hurt. Got nothing to fear from me. Said the fox with a gaggle of geese. I've lost too many mates already. I won't risk it. I can't. Other career lost meats. Say I find your mates. Will you believe I mean no harm? Aye, but I'm not counting either. I mean, too easy. How many are there? Three. 
I will cast that penny. Where will I find Ivo? This Ivo. <clears throat> Where do I look? Edgar contested he'd explore the cave to the east. Try to knock it out his head. Look for it. Bugger would budge. Gaspar do where to look for Gaspar. Or Gaspar. Where will I find him? He said it was defeatist. Said the link to be rescued. We had to take action for or at least. He did. Claimed to have spotted a lantern out to sea. So he said he'd climb the highest peak to look out for a ship. And this last guy, where do I find him? Where'd Farron go? West, in search of a ship that's said to be out there. Farron, he's there. Uh, handy. Thought I might fix it up. Let me see one thing. Okay, I'll try to find your friends. All right. See if I can't find all three. See ya. I'm content to understand. Okay, so this one's the closest one then. Some just eggs then. I don't care about the eggs. To your friends, come down. Right, I'm coming. He's on fire. You lucky devil, you. You know, I've one regret. That. Oh, ah, ah. Dead. Damn. Yeah, I guess. Is this what a dumbass do?
Oh, God. Fuck this bird. Hey, wake up. Shoo. Back to bed, nibbles. Wake up. What? What's happening? Who, who are you? I'm Geralt. Your friends told me to find you. Your friends asked me to find you, Ferenc and Ivo. I'm afraid they're dead. Some horror swarmed Ivo saw it with my own eyes. And Ferenc, I heard him. A blood-curdling cry, then the roar of a beast. Let's get back to the hut. I'll protect you along the way. Shame about the lads, really, but what can you do? Come on. But I should warn you, I suffer from narcolepsy, meaning... <gasps> I know what it means. Don't worry, I'll keep you awake. <sighs> Off we go, then. No, he had something up there. There's a treasure chest up there. I am gonna get that treasure chest. I don't know what's in there, but... Fall down. Fall down to this big hole. Ah. There you go. Come on, get up. Oh, nipples, you're a naughty kitty, aren't you? All right, I'm up. Know much about this isle? Almost nothing. You know, it ain't on my map. A common characteristic of enchanted islands. You think it's enchanted? Of course. It's the one thing I'm sure of. Let's go. That's mm. stronger than me, I'm so sorry. Come on, get up. Oh, the bulls use a naughty kitty, aren't you? <laughs> All right, I'm up. Who's Mr. Nibbles? 
So, what is it brought you to this strange place? Looking for someone. Here? Mm hmm Just kind of turned out that way. Not too keen on talking about it, are you? Not really. This place seems safe enough. Just be sure and come back. <sighs> Make it quick, eh? Not that much to see here. Alright, time to go back. You just see if this guy's still alive there. the fiend stubby legs too slow one of the missing dwarves shame he's dead shame he's dead and so only one survived because he slept most of the time Minimize cat. All right. Brought you your friend. I sure like hearing game. Wake up. Uh, I'm awake. <laughs> Gaspar, stand back. I'm opening the door. Gaspar, you seem a bit muddled. Uh, muddled. A bit drowsy, that's all. What of the others? Found one near a monster's den. He was already dead, sadly. Saw another fall from a cliff. Broke his neck. Shit. Roderick told me to have an eye on the snort. Twas his nephew. Thanks for helping, and uh, sorry I didn't trust you. Oh, everything's gone wrong. What'll we do now? Got a boat. You can leave with me, but I need to find someone first. An ashen haired lass? Yes. Oh, dreadful sorry. Why are you sorry? What do you mean? She's cold. Spirits left her. Must have passed shortly before we found her. Let's wait by the boat. One side. Sword moving. Hmm. 
Yeah. Just heard the moving. There it goes, it stopped. Yeah, this room so, was so small though. Guess not all of Vesemir's teachings have receded into oblivion. A Witcher can forget to eat, to drink, to breathe even. But a Witcher never ever forgets to care for his blade. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, I used to repeat that incessantly. Never tired of doing it either. <laughs> what creature was it? Huh? Creature? One that gave you the scar over your left eye. It's new. I don't remember it. Souvenir from the Cockatrice of Spalna. Another addition to the collection. Nothing special. Oh. Yours has healed beautifully, though. Avalach. He prepared some special ointments for me. But that was before the curse gripped him. I wonder where he is now. We lifted the curse, he's at Karen Morton. We lifted the curse. He's at Karen Morton, waiting for you. Are you serious? You must be. You'd not jest about <laughs> something like that. <laughs> A nice thing to wake up to. You trust him? Avalog? He's not let me down to date. Not once. Your wage with Avalog. How did it start? How do you ever start traveling with Avalach? As soon as I had left you and Yen on the Isle of Avalon, I found myself pursued. Eredin and his Red Riders were on my heels. I fled through many worlds, many times. They came very close to catching me once. It was then that Avalach appeared. Out of nowhere, he found a portal and took us to a world where Eredin couldn't find us for... Oh, perhaps half a year. So why'd you return? So why'd you return? I thought the hunt had lost my scent for good. I thought I was safe. Besides, I... I wanted to find you. You and Yennefer. You were looking for us. We were looking for you. At times I thought you were just a step away. Other times, I felt like I was going around in circles. <laughs> I'm not surprised. There were times I fled pell-mell head first and forward. Tell me everything step by step. So tell me how it happened, step by step. Eredin located us mere moments after we landed on Ard Skellig. Soon after, he and his riders surrounded us. I thought it was over, the end. Turned out Eredin had other plans. He produced the phylactery, uncorked it. A fog enveloped us, and Avalach began gasping for air. That's how Eredin cursed Avalach, triggered his transformation into Uma? Yes. He didn't wish to kill him. Humiliation, that's what he was after. But Avalach refused to succumb without a fight. He cast a spell that wrought havoc in the hunt's ranks. And in a full half of a forest on Ard Skellig. Yet it also gave us time to flee. Avalark opened a portal. I leapt in. He was supposed to follow right behind me, but 
Something went awry. Impaired by the curse, he failed to reach the portal in time. We had agreed that if anything went wrong and we were separated, we would meet at his hideout in Venom. No, I followed the tricks. But you failed to meet there. Yes, we failed to. Once through the portal, instead of at Avalark's hideout, I landed right in the middle of Crookback Bog. I barely escaped the crones. And then there was the Baron. You know he took me hunting. I killed a wild boar with my sword. I heard. A coincidence, really. I had no desire to hunt that day, but it felt wrong to refuse. I'd taken nothing remotely resembling a hunting weapon. I simply hadn't intended to hunt. I was wandering through the forest, breathing deep the air. And then I heard a strange sound, unsettling. Boar attacked you? Mm-hmm. Big as a bison, and lumbering straight at me. And all I had was my sword. I had to manage. Oof. Did just fine, judging by how the Baron's men remember it. Simple soldiers, the whole lot. But we got along splendidly. A shame I had to leave. Flee. But I didn't want to bring the wild hunt down on them. Apart from which, I knew by then the curse was progressing. So instead of looking for Avalach, I decided to find you and Yen. How'd you meet Horson Jr.? So how'd you even meet a man like Horson Jr.? You and Yennefer were nowhere to be found. And I needed someone who could fix the phylactery. No ordinary craftsman would do. I needed a mage. One with extraordinary powers. Dandelion took it upon himself to help me. It was as if his honor depended on it. He arranged a meeting with a mage, but it proved a trap set by the Death of God. Hmm. Failed to mention that. <laughs> Probably didn't want to worry you. Later, we learned the Guard did that sort of thing regularly. In the hope of nabbing anyone who collaborated with mages. We needed to find another way. That was clear. Then Dandelion said he knew a man who owned a piece of Novigrad, as he put it, could do more than others. He was certain to know someone who could fix the phylactery. Orson Jr. Mm-hmm. I suspected it might not be the best idea, but I was desperate. I had no choice. Jr. cheated you and then... You suspected right. Orson was not the ideal partner in crime. Damned Simpleton got it in his head that we cheated him and kidnapped Dudu. Who you promptly freed only to have to flee to Temple Isle. Great idea. We hadn't planned it. Had no time to consider. We just bolted. I didn't even realize the guardsmen were driving me into a trap. Suddenly there I was, and I knew I had to disappear. At once. You didn't land in Skellige. And that's when you landed back in Skellige. The shore of Hindisfjall. The first pleasant place that came to mind. Kjalmar and I used to swim there. Wait, so... You actually wound up there by accident. I thought you and Avalok had arranged something. No, he simply sensed me use my power. Just as Eredin can sense where I am, where I travel. In fact, Eredin arrived soon after I did. His ride is in tow. Once again, things happened quickly. Lofoten, the hunt's attack, my flight. And then, dreams. Just dreams. What did you dream? What did you dream? I've had nothing but nightmares lately. Pretty horrible. Likewise, for the most part. In one, a monster grown from a stillborn child chased you. Ugh. That was horrible. Had a few nice dreams. For example, in one we sat around a fire, drinking good wine, and all around people danced and laughed. I like that one a lot better. Me too. But these dreams, and the others, ended in some tower. No matter what I dream, in the end, I would enter a tower. Recognize the place? Recognize it? Know where it might be? Not sure. I don't think so. But there was something familiar about it. And something terrifying. The tower was stark and dead. But at the same time, I felt I had to enter it. Did you? No. Dreams all ended with me searching for the entrance. And the last time, instead of the tower, I saw your grizzled face. 
If not for the scar over your eye, I'd have thought I was still dreaming. I was afraid you were dead. I was afraid you were dead. Found some dwarves here. Said they'd try to wake you, but you were cold as ice and you weren't breathing. And yet you came in. Who listens to dwarves these days? Speaking of which, they're probably getting antsy. We should go. Got a boat on the beach. Once we land, we'll head for Kaer Morin. On horseback. Right. Conventional means of travel. They're just better. Though a portal would be quicker. And draw Eredin to us immediately. Rather not risk it. Besides, I hate portals. <laughs> This is where I'm going to end it for right now. Oh. Hit the PS button by accident. Welcome back, child. Siri! <sighs> My, you've grown beautiful. No point standing around. Come on, time to greet the others. You've not changed a bit. Any of you. Just like I remembered. <laughs> what? Little sis. Here, everyone you asked for help. Avalox resting in the tower, still in pretty bad shape. No reason to do it out here. Come inside. An obese here. This see you again. Damn, it's good to see you again. Glad to see you, Triss. Thank Yennefer. She's the one who invited me. There'll be time to talk later. We should confer now. 
All right. Yeah, you know the wild hunt better than anyone else. Tell us about the magic. All right. And uh, actually, oh. They also summon the frost that occupies the voids through which they travel. There's just not enough of us. It'll be a hard fight. Ha! Yes. Bring all your tools with. Thought to myself, a battle approach. Thought right. Plan to top that by brewing some more mahakam. Well, of course. <laughs> he doesn't have any skill, really. Oh. Alright, yeah. I'm gonna... Prepare this. And... Then just save it. Alright. You save it over ugly baby. Alright. Put that all in the stream right now. Alright, have a good night.